What's going on guys? My name is Tyler. Welcome back to the channel. We are going to be going over what the Lucid Motors news is today that popped Lucid Motors about four and a half percent. So you guys definitely want to hear this if you are invested in Lucid Motors or if you are thinking about investing in Lucid Motors. So we have a lot to cover. I don't want to waste any time getting into it. Your guys' time is valuable just like mine. Drop that like on the video. Comment down below what is your position size in Lucid Motors as well as consider subscribing to the channel and turning on that notification bell so you'll be notified in real time time when these videos are uploaded so getting right into it guys like i said we popped about four and a half percent and there was quite a bit of news that did come out one piece of this news came out yesterday a lot of this is revolved around today so let's jump right into it guys a lot of this will even surprise you so first off let's talk about the news from yesterday and then let's talk about what happened today so yesterday, Lucid Motors uh, has announced the opening of its first Southwestern United States showroom in Scottsdale, Arizona. The Scottsdale location officially opened its doors on Saturday, August 7th, offering a retail store in the same state as its assembly factory in Casa Grande, which is just 50 miles away. The store is po positioned in Scottsdale Fashion Square, and it's the company's ninth location, adding to the growing network of Lucid Studios. Lucid has opened retail locations in Manhattan, New York, York and West Palm Beach, Florida so far this year, pretty much signifying that we could be getting closer to actually having deliveries get sent out out and it does go on to say right here that this is very significant because it is only 50 miles away and they'll be able to start cranking out vehicles at this store and start getting these delivered so that is essentially what the news is from yesterday let's get into this article it says lucid stock three reasons lucid motors is revving up today for investors lucid motors today is a very good day shares of lcid stock are currently up approximately four percent at the time of this writing today's move comes on a rather divergent day with a risk on sediment showing up among specific groups of stocks. For early stage electric vehicle EV company Lucid Motors, these sorts of big up days have been harder to come by as of late. This day stock that has trended downward since the beginning of the year. In fact, LCID stock has lost more than 60% of its value since its 52 week high as sediment has ebbed and flowed, which is a great thing if you're a long term investor. Obviously, if you're a trader in Lucid Motors, not such a good thing. But if you're buying this for the longer term and they can essentially rival Tesla in many ways, they already are once we do get deliveries of course also as far as specs of their vehicles they do have tesla be there as well but long story short if you're a long-term investor nothing to be concerned about whatsoever that is actually a great buying opportunity now why lucid stock is soaring today among the among the key reasons for Lucid's impressive move today are three catalysts. First, some significant buzz surrounding a massive upgrade for rival Fisker has taken speculative EV stocks higher today. Morgan Stanley analyst Adam Jones set an overweight rating for the upstart EV maker with a price target of $40. For a stock that has been trading around $15 per share in recent days, this is a big upgrade. Additionally, Jones indicated a bull case of $90 per share is a possibility. This news is obviously brought to light the potentially undervalued nature of other EV stocks such as Lucid. And this is very much true, guys. As we do know, Lucid has about 11,000 pre-orders. Last time we were updated on this about a month ago, well over $1 billion worth. Now, take a look at this. Fisker, right? Uh, Fisker car startup Fisker signed, signed an agreement with Foxconn, the Taiwan Taiwanese company that assembles iPhones to co-develop and manufacture a new electric vehicle. Production on the car, which will be sold under the Fisker brand name in North America, Europe, China, and India, will begin in the U.S. by late 2023. We're going to have Project Gravity being delivered by 2023, hopefully be doing about $10 billion or more in revenue per year with Lucid Motors. But uh, it says right here that Fisker has set uh, 17,000 reservations. The Fisker Ocean, Ocean promises to have a very affordable price in the U.S. even without incentives. Scheduled to start production on November 17, 2022, the electric crossover would already have more than 17,000 reservations, according to Fisker. They are not even going to start production until no no November 17, 2022. So Lucy Motors is hopefully will get deliveries by November, but they will be one full year ahead of of Fisker. They should be delivering by 2022 at least 50 to 100,000 vehicles a year if they can get the Saudi Arabia factory built faster than expected. So definitely you can make a case here. Loose Motors is severely undervalued relative to its peers. 
Now, this is also very important as well. Secondly, investors appear to be giving a lot of credence to the Senate passage of President Joe Biden's infrastructure bill. Lucid's Peter Rawlinson was recently quoted discussing the importance of government support for the EV sector in driving the successful performance of rival Tesla. He added, without that funding, the Model S would have never happened. Tesla probably wouldn't exist today. Really, the US government made Tesla the success that it is today. That is a hell of an achievement. This sort of endorsement from government support has encouraged investors cons considering early stage EV plays. If the government can single-handedly fund the infrastructure necessary to boost the sector, companies like Lucid could see a boost. After all, a rising tide lifts all boats. And this is very true, guys. If we get all this money into funding of especially charging stations, that is a huge thing. I know in Michigan, if I bought an electric vehicle, my charging options are very limited. This might be different from other states obviously but michigan you see teslas around right you see electric vehicles around but most of the charging is actually done at home so a lot of people they get that anxiety if they were to you know forget to charge their car overnight for work or something you can't stop at a gas station and charge your vehicle i've not seen one ev charger at a gas station sometimes at car dealerships you'll see these chargers but not at every single one of them so th this is definitely a huge worry for a lot of people if we could get this funding to get chargers at every uh, gas station essentially that's where you'll see a lot of people turning their attention to ev vehicles and one thing that i really love about lucid motors this has not been definitive or not but in their filings they have said that they're going to have dual charging so essentially if you know somebody with an ev with a lucid specifically and you broke down in your lucid you could call your buddy up and he could come charge your car off of his car so i think that takes a lot of the worry away once that information that's going to take a while to get out to the general public but once that does happen and people see the chargers everywhere that's where they'll be more inclined to actually start purchasing lucid vehicles or just evs in general so this is a huge thing and there's a lot of money billions and billions of dollars being allocated to this exact thing now, it says, additionally, this catalyst was backed up with a tweet stating the White House is aiming to help automakers in general battle supply chain issues. More government support is always better. And today it appears the stars are lining for investors in EV stocks such as Lucid. Definitely. This is one that I want to be in on. I want full part and participation in lucid motors i like neo neo is my largest position but lucid motors is getting up to that and i want to make lucid motors the largest position in my portfolio the only thing that is really holding me back at this point is one the lawsuits that they did go through in the beginning of the year and i'm not even worried about that whatsoever but i need to see deliveries happening they have been saying they're get, they're getting ready right they're doing their final validation models that was about a month or two ago they need to start delivering vehicles the sooner the better they have put a big time horizon on this they said by the second half of 2021 which could be december that could happen and th that is really what is holding a lot of people back considering myself as well i do buy shares all the time i'm very bullish on loose motors don't get that wrong but you have to see deliveries start and they have to make good on their promises but they have put these these promises in sec filings so it is going to happen it's only a time game but that'll give a lot of investors a lot of confidence in lucid motors going into the future so when that happens ultimately i think you're going to see a big pop and just referring back to this fisker upgrade guys that there's 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 no denying the valuation differences right fisker is valued at about 70 billion dollars backed by amazon as well once lucid motors really catches steam of that because it's much the same way if you own whatever business or a house next to a a good neighborhood right your house is okay but you have better houses around you do a couple small upgrades paint the walls whatever you guys understand what i'm saying and your house goes up in value just because your neighbor's houses are more valuable that is essentially what is going on with the ev industry as of right now overall lucid is a steal in my opinion i continue to buy the dip so that is going to be all for this video drop the like on the video comment down below and consider subscribing to the channel and turning on that notification bell also check out the links down below in the description there is a link for Weeble. Deposit $100, get four free stocks, each of them potentially worth up to $2,400 a piece. Definitely free money if you guys are not signed up with them. But a broker that I even like more is public. They do not use payment for order flow whatsoever. Your orders go straight to the lit exchanges. Get up to $70 in your choice free stock. 
without depositing a single dollar or linking your bank account. It only takes about three minutes to get your free stock. So if you did this right now, you get your free stock in about three minutes time. Let me know what you get. I've been getting beyond me. You can choose to get whatever you want out of about 20 different choices of the best stocks that you could possibly be invested in, in my personal opinion, for the future. So definitely check that out. It is literally free money. Also, I do have the buy and sellers link down there. You'll be notified in real time as well. Every time a trade is bought or sold in stock options and crypto, whether it's a day trade, swing trade, or longer term investment, that is very inexpensive and it pays for itself. So check those links out. I hope you guys have a great rest of your night. Let me know in the... Let me know in the comment section how many shares you do own. If you're bullish on Lucy Motors, if you're waiting for deliveries, what are you doing? Let me know that information. But with all that being said, I will see you guys in the next video.